Kendrick Glover dedicates his career to supporting young people in Kent and South King County. A lot of our young people are in this area and they don't have a connection to anything. And when you don't have a connection to anything, you will fall for whatever is out there. Uh, my grandmother used to always say, I don't mind, it's the devil's playground. He founded Glover Empower Mentoring, a positive resource he says wasn't available when he was a troubled teenager. Being in gangs, uh, getting involved in drugs at an early age, and it led me to prison at a young age, at the age of 16. And I didn't want to see young people go through the same trauma that I went through. So when I had the opportunity, I wanted to give back to my community in ways that nobody else gave back to me. Now the work they're doing is more important than ever. They serve young people from elementary school all the way to 24 years old, some of them experiencing trauma from their connection to one of the six people killed so far this year in Kent. They have direct relations with a lot of these people, so, you know, whether it's one, two degrees of separation, there's always a direct connection to the work and everything that we continue to see in the community has been no different with you know, the lives that have been lost so far in 2021. The Kent police chief says it's hard to figure out why so many homicides have happened so early in the year. In comparison, there were eight homicides total in 2020, four in 2019, and seven in 2018. Glover says whatever is sparking the violence has a ripple effect. That's the unfortunate part about the six homicides that we've seen in our city this year is life has not been valued. So how do we put value on that life so that not just that one person understands it, but the people around them understands it as well. In a statement, the police chief says both those who commit violence with a gun and those who associate with those who commit violence are multiple times more likely to be shot and killed than those who do not run in those social circles. Because of this, we have remained strong partners with service providers who are focused on intervening with youth before they become part of the criminal justice system. Reasons why organizations like Glover Empower Mentoring are critical to the safety of the young people in the community. We try to make sure that we're inspiring young people to see the value that they have in every arena that they're in, but also the fact that everybody that's in that arena with them also brings value, and that's what makes it a valuable place to be. Frankie Thompson, Q13 News.